School is back in session and young athletes from around the state are back out hitting the courts and fields from high school to club sports. Whether competitive or recreational, sometimes wrist injuries can occur during practice or a game. If you look at basketball, you're more likely to get more injuries for contact sports. Football, you're, um, again, because it's a contact sport, you can see more fractures and especially scaphoid fractures. Dr. Vimala Ramachandran is a hand and wrist specialist with Ortho Arizona. Scaphoid fractures can present as nothing more than a wrist sprain, but for the young athlete, it probably has the most devastating consequences because if it's not treated and it goes on to not heal, it can cause early arthritis in the wrist. A scaphoid fracture can be caused when an athlete falls and hyperextends the wrist. Symptoms include mild to severe pain and swelling. If the fracture has not shifted at all, and by not shifting we mean that there's just a crack through the bone, there's less than a millimeter of displacement, we can actually treat it non-operatively in a thumb cast. And that involves having a cast going from the tip of your thumb down to here. Surgery, which can involve inserting a screw, is another option if the fracture is more serious. It can take eight to 10 weeks for this fracture to heal. The most important thing to do is to get your range of motion back first. So really be diligent about your therapy exercises. Once you get your motion back, the strength comes back. And if you can strengthen the muscles in your forearm and your hand, that will really help should you have another accident where you fall to really help cushion the blow to the bones. 